Hi, my name is Lavish Kumar. In this video, we will learn how to configure CAPTCHA on your NAPCommerce site. For this tutorial, we are using version 4.2. Before we learn how to configure CAPTCHA on your NAPCommerce site, let's define CAPTCHA. A CAPTCHA test is designed to determine if an online user is really a human or a bot. CAPTCHA is a program that can tell whether its user is a human or a computer. You've probably seen them colorful images with distorted text at the bottom of web registration forms. The idea is that no computer program can read distorted text as human can. NAPCOMMERS uses reCAPTCHA. And here on the screen you can see reCAPTCHA is a free service from Google that helps protect websites from spam and abuse. By adding reCAPTCHA to a site, you can block automated software while helping your welcome users to enter with ease. On this site, you can see Google is, has listed a lot of advantages of using reCAPTCHA on your site. You can take a look at these features. And here's the admin console where you can manage all your um, websites and your secret site key to configure reCAPTCHA on your NobCommerce site. So let's look into NobCommerce administration section and see how you can configure your site with reCAPTCHA. From the dashboard section, go to configuration, settings, and general settings. And on the general settings, look for CAPTCHA section right here. If you scroll down and if you enable the CAPTCHA on your site, you can define for what pages you would like the reCAPTCHA image to show up. There are options to show on login screen, registration page, forgot password page, show on context page. Contact page is quite important because that's the place where you can get a lot of spam submissions. So it's always good practice to add CAPTCHA image on your contact us page. In this option, we can also, in this example, we are going to add CAPTCHA on your blog page, comments where spamming can be done from automated programs and bots. So we will add CAPTCHA to prevent those spamming in news page comments as well if you have enabled in show on product review page. And here you will define reCAPTCHA public key and private key that you will get once you register your site on reCAPTCHA website by Google. So all you have to do is Add your keys here and you can simply save it. In this case, I'll get a warning that CAPTCHA is enabled, but the appropriate keys are not entered. So in this case, I will enter on the side. Okay, and what, I, what I've done is I've added my keys. And now all we have to do is Go to the public store, go to contact us page, and here you can see my CAPTCHA image is being displayed right here. So if I make submissions, it won't let me submit unless I verify that I'm not a robot. And it'll ask me to verify if I can select all the images of traffic lights in this case. Similar. Example is if I go to blog, if I pick a blog post, if I try to comment, it will give me option to add to verify that I'm not a robot. So this is how basically how you can configure CAPTCHA on your NAPCOMMERCE site. Now it's time for us to wrap up this tutorial video. Hope this was helpful. This video is brought to you by NAPCOMMERCE, open source shopping cart. Thank you.